Okay, so before we actually get started writing any code, I want to take a moment to highlight a really important resource, which is something called Mozilla Developer Network, or MDN for short. So to get there, I often just end up typing MDN as I'm searching something. So let's say I wanted to know how functions worked in JavaScript. I might say MDN functions and then click on one of these links. It's just a really, really good resource for everything around HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. So the reason I'm showing it to you is we're going to use it a lot uh, and refer back to it. It's sort of going to be our encyclopedia of knowledge and examples. Lots and lots of real developers use MDN. It's an excellent resource for students. It has lots of tutorials and demos, and it's an excellent resource for uh, serious developers who just need a reference. While we have it open, I'll show you a little bit about it. So we want to focus mainly on this web platform side of things. So HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. So if you take a look at the HTML page, we've got a bunch of things, including a reference, which we're going to see in a little bit, a guide to HTML and some tutorials, and a great introduction. So I actually recommend that you pause the video here and you read this entire introduction. It's not very long. Uh, it's a great intro to everything that we're going to talk about in the next few videos. One thing that I always recommend is that you do a little reading before the videos, especially for some of the more advanced topics and newer topics. Do some reading before them so that when you watch the videos, you're able to draw some connections from something you've already read to something that I'm mentioning or some code that I'm showing you. So uh, in summary though, MDN, excellent, excellent resource. You could spend hours and hours on here. We will in the class. Highly recommend that you just get in the habit of typing MDN in your Google searches or going to developer.mozilla.org.